welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here. My name's Emily and today I have a really exciting ASOS haul for you guys. So I have been browsing the ASOS new in on their website and they have some beautiful summer pieces on there and so I thought I would pick some up and show you guys what I found. So if you do like this video, please give it a massive thumbs up and also don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and also turn on the notification bell so you're notified every time I post a new video. So I have just received the parcel and haven't yet opened it so I'm really excited to show you guys what I picked up. I will be doing a try and clip for all the items so you can see what they look like on and I will also leave all of the links to the items in the description box down below so it makes it easy for you guys to shop anything you like. So let's get on into opening up the parcel. I have it just down here and it is so heavy. I can't even lift this up, but this is the parcel. And yes, like I said, it's super, super heavy and I'm just so excited to show you guys what is inside. So the first item I picked up is this beautiful black pop plain puff sleeve dress. This is super, super pretty. And uh, when I saw this on the website, it really reminded me of something that Zara would do, which is why I picked this up. The only thing I would say about this is it does look a little bit big. I actually sized down to a four in this dress purely because the ASOS kind of size guide told me to. So I did listen to it and I did size down to four and I'm really glad I did because it does look quite big. So if you are thinking of ordering this dress, I would definitely size down. And yeah, I just think it's perfect for summer, but also through into the colder months because I don't think you can go wrong with black. You can also pair it with a pair of tights or knee-high boots and it would look really, really pretty throughout the um, winter months as well. So yeah, that is the first item I picked up. So the next thing I picked up is this cotton v-neck blouse and I just fell in love with this on the website. I thought it was so different. It kind of has this like collar detailing on the front. It has a v-neck and it kind of puffs out at the bottom and also this sleeve detailing is so beautiful. It's like embroidered with yellow, orange and pink and I just thought that really does add something to the blouse. I just thought this would be gorgeous for throughout the summer and also again moving into the colder ones because it does have long sleeves so you could wear this all year round. I just absolutely love the design of this and I haven't actually seen anything like this before which is why I picked it up just because I thought it was such a pretty design and just absolutely loved it. This is from a brand called Neon Rose which I've never heard of before but I will be definitely checking out their other pieces on ASOS because this is just beautiful. So the next thing I picked up is this khaki green play suit and this is from Misguided. I really liked the um, lettuce hem detailing around the bottom and around the sleeves on this one. I thought this was perfect for obviously the current circumstances as we are all kind of staying at home. I know we can go out a little bit but for the most part we are at home and this is just super super comfortable. I thought this waistband was really really flattering because you can pull it in at the waist and cinch it in a little bit. The only thing I have noticed with this which I'm really disappointed about is that there is a hole in the sleeve. I don't know if you'll be able to see that on camera but you might be able to see it when I try it on but there is quite a big hole in the sleeve which I'm really disappointed about as I really really do love this play suit. Also it does look a little bit big. It is a UK size 6 and so I thought it would be a little bit smaller than this but overall I really like the design of this and think it will be really flattering apart from the little hole in the sleeve which is really disappointing. So the next thing I picked up is probably quite hard to see on camera but it is this pink floral play suit from Topshop. I really like the design of this when I saw it on the website. It has so much detail on it. It has this kind of like double bell sleeve. It has a ruffle around the top. It has a tie belt at the waist and then on the back it has kind of like this open back detailing which I thought was so so pretty. This is definitely more of a statement piece and maybe something to wear 
for a kind of special occasion, maybe a birthday or a barbecue with your family. I think this would be so, so pretty. And I just absolutely loved how much detail went into this play suit. I thought this would be perfect to just pair with a little pair of sandals and it would just look super, super cute. So yeah, I'm really, really happy with this. I think again, the waist detailing will be really, really flattering as it kind of cinches in at the waist and also comes with this belt, which is detachable. So you could add in your own belt if you wanted to mix it up a little bit, which is always great as it allows us to change the look of something and rewear and rewear which is amazing. So yeah, I'm really happy with this and just think it's absolutely stunning. So this is the next piece I picked up. It is this polka dot dress from River Island. And when I saw this on the website, I just absolutely fell in love with it. It has kind of like different sized polka dots running throughout the dress. And I just think it's such a statement piece, but it's also very, very wearable. The material of this is insane it's so so soft it's also lined on the inside so it's not going to be see-through and i just think this is going to be so pretty but also so comfortable for throughout the summer you wouldn't get too hot in this it is quite an airy kind of dress and it has this like sheared detailing around the bust area which is always so flattering and then it has a kind of tiered effect skirt coming down to a mini dress. It also has these kind of tie detailing on the um, strap so you could adjust this to fit you the way you want it to which is amazing and yeah I just love this and I'm really really happy I picked this up. I just think it's so so pretty and it's so girly as well. It's just beautiful. So the next thing I picked up is this cream coloured crinkle jumpsuit and this is so so pretty and it's really giving me like that holiday kind of vibe it's made of this crinkle material it has spaghetti straps at the top and it has this really nice detailing around the neckline where it kind of ruches up it has a cinched in waist which is always amazing and then the legs come down to this elasticated cuff at the bottom meaning these trousers will probably be quite puffy which is really nice as because the top of the jumpsuit is really cinched in and really kind of tight fitting it's nice to have this kind of contrast detailing on the legs so yes I really love this and I honestly can't wait to wear this on holiday even like on a plane journey I just think this would be so comfortable it's a nice quality material it's not too thick but also not too thin so yeah I just love this and think it will be perfect for throughout summer and for holidays when we can actually get there <laughs> So the next thing I picked up is this floral blouse and the material on this is like a linen material so really breathable for throughout the summer. The bodice of this is in this crinkle fabric which is really really flattering and then it just kind of peplums out at the bottom. It has a square neckline which is really really flattering and just these long sleeves. This would be perfect for like a summer evening, maybe going to a barbecue or out with your friends. It would just keep the cool breeze off you and I just think this is absolutely beautiful really really classy as well and just a great structured blouse for throughout the summer you could dress this up a lot more as well or you could also wear it casually with a pair of denim shorts so yeah i'm really happy i picked this one up i just absolutely love the floral patterns recently they're just really catching my eye and quite a lot of retailers have some beautiful floral patterns and i just think they are really classic and they aren't going out of style and I just absolutely love them so yeah so the next thing I picked up is this one shoulder pink knitted top and this does look really really tiny <laughs> on the camera but it is a really really stretchy material so the one thing I would say about this is that I was very misled on the website because I thought this was actually the top and the knitted trousers that go together as a cohort but unfortunately only the jumper has arrived so obviously you have to order the jumper and the trousers separately but there wasn't actually an option on the ASOS website to choose the trousers as well so I'm not sure what has happened but 
I'm really kind of annoyed about it as I was expecting the jumper and the trousers but there's nothing I can do. I really do like the jumper on its own so this probably would be great with a pair of jeans, maybe a dark wash jean. I think this would look really, really pretty. I love the one shoulder cutout. I just think it's really on trend and just kind of like a statement piece. So yeah, nevertheless, I really love this. I love the pink colour and just love the way that it is going to fit. So yeah, this is the final clothing item I have to show you. So the next thing is this teeny tiny ring and I absolutely loved this on the website. I have seen this sort of ring all over Instagram and have just fallen in love with it. So I found this on ASOS, it was only £5 and I did actually expect it to be a lot more kind of cheap looking and cheap feeling than it is. It feels really, really nice quality, it doesn't look cheap at all and I just love it. So this is what it looks like. I just absolutely love this ring and I'm so happy I picked it up. I went for it in the small because I do have quite slim fingers and it does fit me perfectly and I'm just so happy with this one. I really, really am so happy with this. I'm going to keep it on while I carry on. So the next thing I picked up is quite an interesting one. I picked up the Mane and Tail Shampoo and Conditioner. This is the deep moisturising one for dry and damaged hair. I have heard amazing, amazing things about this and they always sell out on ASOS and I've been waiting for them to come back in stock and they finally have. I think these are about £6 each and like I said, I've heard amazing things about these. They really help to promote hair growth and obviously Obviously, at the moment I haven't been able to have my hair done and so my hair is really feeling quite dry and damaged so I'm so excited to finally get to try these out and yeah I will let you know how I get on if you want to follow me over on my Instagram it's just at underscore Emily underscore Louise I will let you know how I get on with these as I am just so excited to try them out and then the final thing I picked up is this Revolution Conceal and Define Concealer. This is my favourite ever concealer. I just think for the price, I think it's about £5, it just works so, so well. The only thing I would say about it is it does run out quite quickly, but for the price, you can't really fault it and it's such good coverage. I just absolutely love this concealer. So if you are looking for a new concealer, definitely check this one out as it's my absolute all-time favourite. So guys, unfortunately that is the end of this ASOS haul. I feel like I picked up some absolutely beautiful pieces and I hope you think so too. Do leave your favourite item in the comment section down below as I would love to know what you guys thought of these items and I have an idea maybe to do an accessories haul if that is something you guys are interested in or if you have any other video ideas that you want to see from me definitely leave them in the comment section down below as I would love to know what you guys love to see on my channel so thank you so so much for watching if you did like this video please leave a massive thumbs up down below and also don't forget to hit that subscribe button and also turn on the notification bell so you're notified every time I post a new video. Again, thank you so much for watching. Bye!